Chad. You can see my little male clownfish is hanging out with something. And I know it doesn't look quite like it, but that is actually a rose bubble tip anemone. It looks pretty sad, doesn't it? It's still alive, but it has been beat up. What beat it up? Hmm. Yep. My old nemesis, the banded coral shrimp. I had one years ago, and <clears throat> he didn't act very well in my tank. So I got rid of him by trading him off. And time passed, and I thought, as with many other creatures, that maybe that was just a aberration. Because sometimes you get a creature with a bad temperament. So I thought maybe I just had one with a bad temperament. They're so beautiful that I thought <clears throat> that I would try again. You can see how fascinating this creature is. I mean, he's just absolutely neat looking. But the behavior persisted. And so I'm going to get rid of this one too. It took me a long time to capture him and get him into this container. Um, and he had done some damage in the meantime to different corals. And you can see things are kind of hiding out and whatnot because of him. And he really beat up that anemone. Now it is living, you know, mouth is closed, it's holding on, seems to be doing okay, and the uh, tentacles are growing back, which he had snipped off. So, here we go, I'm going to get rid of him, I'm going to get some uh, regular skunk cleaner shrimp and some peppermint shrimp like I've had before, and this will be the, the last time that I ever try the banded coral shrimp in a tank that has corals of any kind. Alright, thanks for watching guys, talk to you later, bye bye.